All right, man, it's rumors that starting to leak out in the NFL schedule um, that Detroit Lions could be taking on the Miami Dolphins Thanksgiving Day uh, 2022. I mean, to switch up, I think we played Chicago uh, quite a few times on the Thanksgiving matchup, man. But let's talk about it. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe button. It's the bell icon button. Uh, thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe button. The like comment button, hit on notifications, free chance and notifications. Uh, you want financially support the channel, cash app, dollar sign, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link in description. So, um, it'd be interesting, you know, it would have been interesting about it, bro, had they uh set it up where um they play Dallas on Thanksgiving and give us a different midday uh game or a different early game, but then. The night game. So Lions have lost one, two, three, four, five. Hold on, let me make sure I read these back. One, two, three. Yeah, five uh Thanksgiving days in a row. They lost them to Minnesota, Chicago twice, Houston. And then they, that's when Deshaun came and they got fired by when they lost to Chicago. So we played Chicago three of the last four years. And we played uh NFC North opponent. Uh five of the last six years. And I think it boils down to a re I think it boils down to a regional thing. They want people to be able to play on Thanksgiving and get back home as quick as possible. So I'm not sure how long a, a flight from Miami to uh Detroit is or Miami just uh um to stay in Detroit and have their family follow up and have Thanksgiving there. The flight is uh on that two hours and three hours. So yeah, you know, they'd be done about what. Three, they can make it back about six or seven, eight. So yeah, they can be in time back for, for dinner if they wanted to. So it ain't the longest flight. I know they try to be reasonable with you know how they get people passed by Indiana and all that. Houston probably stay because that's a longer flight. But it says Thanksgiving Day matchup uh on tap for the Dolphins. All signs are pointing to the Miami Dolphins facing, De facing Detroit Lions on Thanksgiving. We said we're up to nine NFL games revealed for the 2022 season after announcement Tuesday morning that the different Broncos would face. The Los Angeles Rams at SoFi Stadium on Christmas. That's going to be a good one right there. You know, they're trying to take the shine away from the NFL. They must be beefing with the NFL, boy. More specifically, uh, expect the NFL to announce the Dolphins will be facing the Detroit Lions at Fort Field in the first game of the day. As revealed to the LA Los Angeles Times by Vice President of NFL Broadcasting Planning Michael North, the league is back to its format of having Detroit and Dallas rotate hosting AFC uh, for the Thanksgiving Day afternoon games. So, Dolphins fought the, the Raiders played the uh, Cowboys last year. We played a division, so that's what they're doing. They rotate AFC teams based on these rotations because the Lions are hosting this season the Dolphins, Bills, along with the AFC opponents of the Jacksonville Jaguars, seven for the seventeen game. North, however, told. L.A. Times, the Lions will be hosting either the Bills or the Dolphins. So, Pro Football Network reported that the Dolphins will be the Detroit's 2022 Thanksgiving Day opponent, which makes sense on a couple of levels. First, Buffalo played on Thanksgiving in both 2019 at Dallas and 2021 at night versus New Orleans Saints. And it would be unusual to have the Bills play on uh, this day a third time for, in four years. Second, the Dolphins-Lions matchup is neutral given Detroit head coach Dan Campbell served as the Lions interim head coach for the final 12 games 2015 season. The Dolphins Thanksgiving Day history. The Dolphins have played Detroit on Thanksgiving once. Winning 27-10 to 10 in 2006, they were led by former Lions quarterback Joey Harrington. I vividly remember that game. He finally played like a number one overall pick. Overall, Miami has appeared on Thanksgiving seven times, but not since 2011 when the Dolphins dropped 20-19 decision against the Dallas Cowboys in the last second field goal by Dan Bailey. Of course, the biggest Dolphins Thanksgiving highlight came in 1977 when they played at St. Louis, one of only two times 1975 with the other. The NFL had an afternoon game on Turkey Day someplace other than Dallas or Detroit. With Brian Greasy, with Brian Greasy Bob Greasy famously wearing eyeglasses, the Dolphins had a single game franchise record for points that still exists to this day, 55-14 route of the Cardinals. At the time, it was the St. Louis Cardinals. So, Dolphins Thanksgiving, uh, they played Dallas and say, you know, they played Dallas most of the time, one, two, three, four, five times out of this. So, um, 
and you look at their all-time record, you know, they played 83 games on this day. The, the, the NFL has been trying to get the lines removed off this day for a very long time, but the four is always lawyer up and they were the one team that you know, volunteered back in the day when nobody wanted to play on Thanksgiving and they don't want to get that up because that's a really, really financial, financially fruitful day. Um, you know, that's a really financially fruitful day for the, uh, the Fords. So like I said before, people always go down there and it's just a terrible, it's just terrible going down there. You got the parade, they do runs down there. Um, it's hard to get out of there after the game. I mean, it's a whole bunch of drunk. People. I used to hate working that game. It's a whole bunch of drunk people. Um, you know, just, just, you know, it's just, it's really, you know, it's really not that fun to be honest. Um, you know, but you know, especially if they don't lose, it's not that fun. But you know, at the same time, it is what it is. People keep pouring money in the fours. They don't care about winning. I keep telling y'all that. Um, they just care about y'all bringing y'all money in there. Yeah. But nonetheless, not to make this a four thing. But um, yeah, the Dolphins cool. I remember Joy Harris who came and host us. I just said that on the live stream. But uh, yeah, I, I remember he came and host us, man, and uh. He dogged us out. So, I mean, it is what it is, man. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, yeah, the Dolphins, good game. You can see Tyreek Hill. I mean, uh, Jalen Waddle, they got a lot of speed. It's a matchup that, that you know, pretty much worried about being a blowout because, you know, how Philadelphia was. They was just – they weren't the best team we played to that point. But they just had a lot of speed. It was a bad matchup for us, man. They brought a lot of speed. So, um you know, they were a lot of speed and we can handle it. And, you know, Miami come with a lot of speed. The issue is can they quarterback get the ball to that speed down the field? Intermediately, yeah, they get the ball to him, but it could be a bad matchup. But the quarterback could even it out. They got a good defense. Xavier Howard, one of the better corners in the game. So um, we have to wait and see, man. But um, yeah, let me know what you girls and guys think. But the last, you know, we lost the last five. I mean, one through, we got four in a row prior to that. Keep losing to Houston. We lost to them in OT. So, yep. Could be Miami. Let me know what you girls and guys think. Check Detroit Lions talk playlist out for more videos like this. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Make the subscribe button. Hit the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase the chance. Get notifications. We go live. Or drop a video. Financial and support the channel. Cash app, dollar sign, CJ Good313. Venmo, CJ Good313. PayPal in the description. Uh, rest with a donate. Just thumbs up. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Check Detroit Lions talk playlist for more videos like this. Let me know what you girls and guys think in the comment section. Peace.